In this video, we will go over how to register for classes in Banner 9 Self-Service. Go to miamioh.edu slash student registration. Log in with your Miami credentials. Select Registration from the Student Services page. You will be taken to the main registration page where you'll be asked, what would you like to do? By this time, we've taken care of all pre-registration requirements and we've pre-planned with the Browse Classes feature. Now we're ready to register for classes. Let's click that option. Then select the term. Again, we are selecting the summer term for example purposes. Then click the Continue button. You will advance to the Register for Classes screen. There are three tabs on this screen. Find Classes. The functionality is similar to the Browse Classes feature, if you've seen that video. Enter CRNs. If you used the Browse Classes feature to prepare for registration, and you've made note of the CRNs for the classes you wish to register for, you would use that information here. And lastly, the Schedule and Options tab. This view shows the courses and your status in each course. In the first part of this video, we'll register for classes using the Find Classes tab. Under Search Criteria, type or select the subject you wish to browse from the drop-down menu in the subject box. In our example, the subject we're searching for is Anthropology. If you know the course number, I recommend typing it into the drop-down menu. You can expand and condense the columns to your liking to show or hide additional information. Once you've found the class you wish to register for, click the Add button. In the lower third of the window, there is a summary pane. The summary pane will now show the class you've just added with the status of Pending, and the Action column reflects Web Registered. You are not yet registered for this class. To complete registration for the course, click the Submit button. If you successfully add the class, the status will change to Registered. If you are unsuccessful in adding the class, error messages will display in the upper right-hand corner to let you know why you cannot add the class. If you receive a course's closed error with a waitlisted message, you can join the waitlist. We'll go over that in another video. Repeat as necessary until you have registered for all of your classes for the semester. Next, we'll go over the Enter CRNs tab. If you already have your desired CRN on hand, you can enter it into the CRN search box. To add multiple CRNs, click Add Another CRN for each additional class that you wish to register for. When you are done, click the Add to Summary button and the courses will be added to the summary pane. Once you have all of your desired CRNs entered, click Submit. If you successfully added the class, the status will change to Registered. If you are unsuccessful in adding the class, error messages will display in the upper right-hand corner to let you know why you cannot add the class. If you receive a course's closed error with a waitlisted message, you can join the waitlist. Finally, if you wish to check your work, click the Schedule and Options tab to review your registration. And that's how you register for classes. Remember, do not hesitate to contact your advisor or review the One Stop website for further assistance. See you in the next video.